Welcome to the Old Timer Centre. My name is Philip Tarrant and I'm going to be talking to you about this very late 2003 Audi RS6. It's done 270,000 kilometres but this car is in excellent condition with an incredible service history. It's a Canberra car and it has done a lot of highway kilometres and it's got the twin turbo V8 engine. It's dark metallic grey in colour with cream leather seats and charcoal carpets and dash which is great just means you don't have to clean the carpets every time you get in and out of the car. Although it has done 270,000 kilometres, as I mentioned, they are freeway kilometres. And the good thing about cars like this, like an RS6, a BMW M5, a Mercedes E55 AMG, whatever it might be, they're built tough. You know, if this was an Audi, a6 with a two litre turbo engine in front wheel drive, I'd be pretty concerned with 270,000 kilometres. Being an RS6, it's got much stronger diffs, gearbox, engine, everything is built to last. That's why when you go online you can see older, say BMW M5s from the late 80s, early 90s with five and 600,000 kilometres. There have been some Audi S6s and RS6s over the years which have come and gone with three to 400,000 kilometres. So these cars are capable of big Ks if they're looked after. It's totally standard. It hasn't had different wheels or an exhaust or bigger turbos or anything fitted to it. It's, not, it's basically standard as it was when it was new. It's just had very regular maintenance by its specialist in Canberra. For some reason when we seem to get some really good cars out of Canberra it's quite possibly because unlike Sydney you know they're not sitting in traffic all the time you know it hasn't had tens of thousands of hours of idling in traffic on the way to the city you know generally cars from Canberra have had a pretty easy life other than maybe hitting the odd kangaroo in some cases. So I'll have a look at this book. So it's done 270,000 kilometres. You can see it's done some Ks. The last service was only done a couple of months ago at 265,000 kilometres at Canberra VW Centre. They also specialise in Audi, obviously. You can see here it's was serviced twice this year. And uh, let's have a look, 235, 250. So it's very consistent all the way through. And it's nice that it's been with the same mechanic. Sometimes it'll go to one, they might have an issue with it, so then they'll change mechanics, go to someone else. And you've got stamps all over the place. It's been consistent all the way through. And before that, it was serviced at an Audi dealership. Yep, and it's very consistent all the way through. Look, and with some of these cars, it's all about you know service history. You may see one with 120 or 130,000 kilometres, you think, oh, gee, that seems like a good car. But then, you know, it doesn't have a logbook. You don't know if it's been serviced in the past 12 months or five years. This has had two services this year, as I said, by the specialist. And it's a car which I think really needs to be seen to be appreciated. And uh, you need to take it for a drive. It's, the gearbox is nice and smooth. It's quiet. It starts perfectly, um, this may be obvious, but th there's no smoke at all or anything on startup. It starts cold perfectly, it starts hot perfectly. The headlights are nice and clear. With all A6s and RS6s, they seem to go. They just oxidise, basically. It's a great colour combination, and I think it's a very special car. Whether you want it, it's something you want to drive every single day, whether you're a collector, you may have a few cars and you want something to drive on the weekends, whatever it might be. 
happy to do all of it. As I said, it's only done 5,000 kilometres since the last service a couple of months ago. All the gauges are good, the air conditioning's ice cold. You can see the wear and tear on the steering wheel are very good, including the seats. And it really is a very impressive car and very good value for money for under $20,000. It's got about 330 kilowatts, which propels this car from zero to 100 in about 4.6 or 4.7 seconds. The good thing about the RS6 is it's a Quattro, obviously being an Audi, and it really puts a power to the road. Now you get some of these big, big engined AMGs or BMWs, which is great, and you put your foot down, all you see is traction control on. And you, you know, the wheels start spinning. Whereas with these, it puts power to the road and gets up and goes, whether it's rain, snow, hail, sun, whatever it might be. It's even got heated seats in the back, heated seats in the front, navigation, parking sensors, obviously. There weren't a lot of options on these, they just pretty much came with everything. But it really is a very impressive car. Look, we don't often keep cars in here with, you know, 270 or 300,000 kilometres, but this was just too good. And it was a trade-in on a 6.3 litre AMG Mercedes. And we just couldn't, you know, there was no way we were going to send this car to auction or to another dealer. It's a car you should come in and have a look for yourself. If you do have any specific questions about the car, you can contact us on 02956999. You can speak to myself, my name's Philip. You can also speak to Richard, he used to own an RS6 just like this one, which he had um, pretty much since it was new. So he's, he can speak to you as someone who's actually owned one. I, I haven't owned an RS6 myself. I've driven a number of them. And uh, I certainly know what they are. But if you've been looking for a good one for some time and you'd like a a car which is in a reasonable price range, this is the car for you. I appreciate you taking the time to watch this video. We're located only 20 minutes from Sydney Airport. You've got easy access to our dealership from Sydney CBD as well. We look forward to hearing from you and our contact number is 02 95